Welcome back to my channel, Mallorca Under the Sun, for the last time this year in 2021. Now, I just want to say a huge thank you to each and every one of you who have taken time out from your busy lives to have watched my videos or my live streams. And it has been an absolute pleasure to bump into so many of you here on holiday as well over the course of the year. And also big thank you too for all the lovely comments that I have had on my YouTube channel and also in my Facebook group. So thanks very much, guys and um, I'm looking forward to seeing many more of you on the island in 2022. The year got off to a really difficult start and for me it was really hard to make videos here on the island to try and tempt you out here when all the bars and the restaurants had been closed at the beginning of the year and it was actually illegal to meet up with anybody outside of our homes. Now I'm starting my walk down by the Hotel Miramar and the hotel is in fact boarded up and there is a sign that says that the next opening will be the 1st of April 2021 but as you can see it hasn't actually happened yet. Now with all the restrictions that we do have in place over here in Mallorca you must wonder what life is like and I can say actually it's quite chilled. Um, I just passed a group out fishing this afternoon and over on this platform here there's another group doing yoga so life is pretty much going on as normal but with a few restrictions in place. Now by the time we got to May I was wondering whether the island was going to open up as normal with still so many hotels closed and so many attractions waiting to open up. <laughs> Now, when I made my video down here back in, I think it was December or the back end of November, I was really, I guess, a little overly optimistic as to what we would be seeing opening up this spring. Now, you know, we can hardly believe actually that we're pretty much in the same situation as we were six months ago. And, but it is even worse because the attractions here just have not opened in the way that I had hoped and the way that you had hoped for those of you that are planning to come over here this summer. But when we got to the end of June, the islands pretty much opened up almost as normal for summer, with face masks being worn outside, not being made a legal obligation, and summer pretty much went on as normal. did my very first live stream back in May as well and it is a fantastic way to connect with you guys back home and also to give you a real-time view of what the island is like in a very unedited way. It was also great as well to bump into those of you who are out here on holiday and came to say hello to me while I was filming. And these are some of my live stream highlights from New Yorker in 2021. Is that you? <laughs> no way. Okay, someone who has just commented, Mallorca 13, they've just got married here. I don't know if you can see them. Give everyone a big wave. <laughs> Can't believe it. Brilliant. No, really nice to see you guys. Take care, bye. <laughs> I'm live at the moment. Yeah, do you want to say hello to anyone back home? <laughs> Lovely yeah. place to come, wouldn't it? Absolutely amazing. I'm just talking about how fantastic Carmen Over is. So, it's do you. Incredible. You're having a good holiday. How long oh, have yeah. you been here? Yesterday. Yesterday. Yeah. Yesterday. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, there's so much to do here and there's so much open as well. Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> what's, what's your name, by the way? Simon and Sam. Like, really nice to, to meet you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks very much. Have a really good holiday. Bye. Oh, hello. <laughs> You see me, I'm live at the moment. Would you like to say hello? Hello. <laughs> What's your name? Caliban, Bill and Miriam. Oh, brilliant. Oh, welcome. We watch your channel. Oh, bless you. <laughs> You're watching me live. Oh, my goodness. Who are you visiting from? Uh, from uh, Luxembourg. Really nice to see you. <laughs> really nice to meet you. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your holiday. Bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> Now guys, in August, I was reminded of the importance of having really good health insurance. Whether you live out here 
or whether you're visiting the island on holiday. And that was when my daughter had an accident with her toe and she ended up in hospital, pretty much killing off the rest of our summer holiday and also meaning that she had to spend a week in hospital and pretty much a month in the cast, which wasn't the best fun to be had. But we had a busy September and October right up to the end of the season, with the visitors to the island trying to get in a quick summer break before the hotels closed. But at the end of October, as we do every single year here in Mallorca, we always question the end of the season and we cannot understand why tourism still does not go on as normal in November and December. But November, we had one of the wettest months in history. Well, one of the wettest Novembers in history. Okay, it's absolutely throwing it down here now. The wind's come in. I'm wondering if this, this Medicaine has finally arrived. It's super windy here. And in December, we've had some fantastic Christmas lights to enjoy all over Palmer City Centre. So thanks very much for watching. Please keep dreaming, keep planning, keep getting inspired and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell so you know when I next upload my video if you're thinking of coming to the island this summer. So a happy new year everyone and I will see you on the other side on my next video in 2022. Goodbye for now.